Hi, this is a response to Jim um, Retro Buzz contest. Um, and congrats on the 50 subs, or well, more now that I saw. Um, so you want us to show us stuff that friends wouldn't believe is in our collection? Or um, things that we're embarrassed to show? Well, as everyone knows, I don't have much um, in terms of records right now, so everything I have is stuff that I'm not embarrassed to have on my shelf. But I saw other formats were allowed, so I looked through the closet and I had Sailor Moon, um, this, the best song collection. And this is actually a Japanese import, as you can see on the back of the kanji symbols for the titles. There's some English next to the kanji symbols, but for the most part, it's um, in Japanese. But this one's called Heart Moving, and this one I, I always thought was my favorite. And if that wasn't enough, I have the instrumentals, which they aren't the same. Um, they're like music box-like, you know, like they're way different. Um, now, anime isn't something that people would be surprised about me because my name on here is Ayaka Star, and Ayaka is from Tenshi Muyo, if you didn't know. Um, it used to show on Cartoon Network during the Toonami um, segment, and that's when Sailor Moon was on, so I think I just used to watch it after Sailor Moon. And um, what's kind of embarrassing is that I didn't get into Sailor Moon till like 11th grade, so at the same time that I was buying these, I was buying these Radiohead bootlegs I last showed. So that's what is crazy about this, that I liked both things. And not only that, I have other um, fanatical things related to anime. I have the manga, which I guess isn't that big of a deal. And But I have these, these little action figures. I don't have the Sailor Moon one, but the other ones, <laughs> these are crazy. They were in the closet too. And I have um, a cell on my wall. I actually used to have more anime cells, but I made some money off of them on eBay, so um, I no longer have my Tenshi Muyo ones, which is kind of disappointing. but. I had to, I had to make money, so, um, oh, uh, I'm going to play a bit from the instrumental one real quick so you know the, um, difference between the two. So, yeah, this is it. Um, as you can see, it's like a lullaby, so... I was really into this, and I actually thought it was like, you know, like the pretentious version of the um, original. I was like, yes, I have um, this great, this better quality, you know, because I always thought instrumentals equaled like, you know, pretentious back then, so. <laughs> um, and this is very relaxing music, so, yeah. Um, Oh, and if I hadn't sold stuff that I used to own, like cassettes and stuff, because I used to have like um, a ton of cassettes um, in, when I was little in the 80s, but I probably sold them in a garage sale or half price books, I don't know. I still have like burned cassettes, or not burned, well you know what I'm saying, like um, ones that I recorded on myself, but none of the actual albums I owned. Um, I used to have Milli Vanilli even, and it's crazy, but I still sometimes um, hum in my head, blame it on the rain, and like sometimes I'll change it up like, you know, like if I'm having a bad day, I'll be like, blame it on the sinuses, yeah, yeah. Anyway, 
it was kind of tragic what happened there. I actually had to read up on it because mom's like, but it's so tragic to mention Millie Vanilli because of the whole lip syncing thing and then the one guy dying. Um, I really, I knew about the lip syncing obviously, but I didn't really pay attention to them after that initial time when I was little and had the cassette. And anyway, I guess that's one thing that probably people would be like, what? You know, like, um, so yeah, um, congrats again and this is um, all I have to show for now. I'll be checking out more of your videos, hopefully, and I'm, I actually checked out the Dolly Dots and they're really interesting. In 1981, I was actually thinking, I wonder what albums from the year I was born, you know, that I missed out on, and I was like, hmm, Dolly Dots, okay. Anyway, take care.